All right, we are in New York City at the Americana. I think that's what you call it. The hustle and bustle of New York outside. I'm here for men's health. But we've got a power pack trip that we're going to take you along. I got Trayvon Deere behind the camera. We're capturing the whole thing. We came here to shoot men's health. I literally came to New York City in 1998, 1999, hoping to work with men's health. 25 years later, here we are. Yes, legitly 25 years later. It's wild. And then we're going to Barstool Sports to see Feidelberg. I actually pick up Feidelberg, tour the office, head over to Kenny Santucci's, you know, uh, famously from the Road Rules and Strength New York. We're going to do the 1,000 pound club of Feidelberg. It's going to be awesome. So not only are we hanging out at Men's Health, we're hanging out with fights, we're hanging out with Kenny Santucci, and you are along for the ride. I can't wait to take you. Let's go. Woo! Ah! Nice, love it, love it. Yeah, I see that old school kind of, yeah, beautiful. Classic right there. Nice, buddy, good. Great. Nice, buddy. Good. Yep, for you, good. Nice. Good, 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 good. Hey, what's up, bro? How you doing, man? This is Trayvon. Trayvon, what's, what's up, bro? How you doing? John. I did. Yeah, yeah. Please do those. I just did five of the new Pump 30 workouts for men's health today. Damn. Right. You would do it. Nice, nice, nice. Good. I'm making a motion. Is this a uh, Yeah. Is this is Yeah. They want it, it seems like, it seems like him, right? Yeah. We got our boy, Kenny Santucci, right here. We're in strong New York. And we're going to see can jump, equal up a thousand pounds between squats, bench, and deadlift. I think the consensus is that he's a fucking sandbagger, and I think he can do it. But we're about to find out today. I don't think I don't think Men's Health, your boy Corey G. Now I'm 45 years old, I'm a father of three, and I live the busy life. So how did I get this jacked? By training my ass off. And I'm better known as Corey G, of the creator of the Dad Bod Shred Workout. And for the last half decade, I've proven to guys everywhere, including myself, that you can always be strong and ripped no matter what. I've had injuries I've struggled through. In periods where I couldn't get all the workouts in like I wanted, I've battled all kinds of issues. But right now, I'm 185 pounds. And strong enough still to bench over 300. And you'll get it done in the dad bod shred. Which so he was the first weightlifter and the first coal miner. Oh, really? And so my grandfather was only nine at the time. He was already teaching him how to lift weights. And then that's the guy who taught me how to lift weights. But my dad, his dad, my grandparents, all my uncles, like every, everybody, Whoa. all minors. Cool. Yeah. yeah, so it's pretty cool. So it's good. Uh, so like, I'm the only one. Everyone else looked at weights too, but they just did as a hobby. Obviously, mm -hmm. after they come home from working for like 15 hours, they'd still be benching 300 pounds. Wild. When did you start lifting? Uh, so my grandfather, I'm, I moved in. Uh, my parents got divorced when I was 11, and we had to live with my grandparents like right around that time. And he started teaching me lifting weights. Then. So I was probably like, like 12 or 13 years old, and then I caught on to it, and I. I like missed about two months my freshman year of high school, but since my sophomore year of high school, I've never missed more than a week, probably. Really? Yeah, like dead on. We know we were shooting a promo. <laughs> I got the pretty string too. That's what I used for the. He, he ain't ready for that, I don't know. Buddy, you put a little of this between your butt cheeks, you'll be fine. <laughs> I don't know if that's a great combo. I don't know from experience. I don't know from experience, but I just heard. I read yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. It was on Reddit. He told me. <laughs> this is gonna set. This is gonna set the right. Oh, I'm set. Used to just working out on SSRIs, but there you go. There you go. Straight to the jaw. Bites. Good. Chest up. Go back, 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 back. Yeah, all day. It's a fucking wrap. You got this. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. He got it. And then if you can rotate around back towards me, if that's possible. You're almost there. Nice, nice, Corey. Good, 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 good. Should you bring it in closer? Corey, can you bring it in a little closer? Nice, nice, nice. Relax, relax, relax. <laughs> Let's go now. Strong, strong. Get out of there, John. Get out of there. Chest up. Chest up. Get back. Hold the track. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 
Nice, nice. Good for it, love it. Nice, good. I think I like the other one better. Okay, cool. Yeah. Great, but I think you might need to shoot from a different angle. Yeah. Um, you kind of lose. Come around. Nice. Good. Same exact shit. Come on. Same thing, John. Come on. Tight. Come on. Come on. Chest up. Gotta go. Back! 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 Yeah! That's what the fuck I'm talking about. Thousand pound club right now. John Feidelberg, Barcelona. This has got to be the best athlete at Barcelona sports right now. I know it. Don't listen to that, Will.